Hey girls, it's Lexi and um, I am going to be doing a video for you guys again today. Duh, that's what this is. But anyways, um, and I really didn't feel like doing a tutorial and um, my skin's pretty scary so I didn't really want to do a tutorial so I'm going to do a tag video. It's going to be the first tag video that's going to be on my channel and I try to find one that I've never seen anybody do. Um, I kind of searched, I think I searched makeup questions tag, and these are the questions that I got. They're 25 questions, and before I start, I'm going to go ahead and tag um, all of you to do this. Yeah, response um, of that, so I can see it as well and see your answers, because these are some really good makeup Here questions. they are. I'm going to be reading them off my computer. Okay, the first one is, do you apply foundation with a brush, sponge, or your fingers? Um, I use either my fingers or a brush. Um, I used to use a sponge a long time ago, and it's not that I don't like it, because I do. Um, actually, it used to be one of my favorite ways to do it, because you just kind of sponged it on. And a lot, a lot of people nowadays use, um sponges like beauty blenders which are really good to use and yes I'm wearing glasses <laughs> I don't have my contacts in because my eyes have been weird today but anyways um so right now I've been using a brush just because it um applies my makeup the best for me and yeah so that's my answer is brush okay number two do you apply eyeshadow from light to dark or dark to light um I usually start with the lightest color first, like the highlight. I usually use that first just because you can kind of tell where you're going to apply the dark easier and to stay away from the light color. So, yeah. Number three, do you prime your eyes? This is kind of a iffy question for me because I do it sometimes and then other times, you know, I'll just say, nah, I won't. So, it just kind of depends, I guess. But it does help. I can always tell a difference whenever I do prime my eyes and it like doesn't make them crease as much. Um, the next conceal thing first or conceal last. Um, I think I used to conceal after I put my foundation on, but oh goodness. But for, like since here recently I've just been using um, my concealer before my foundation just to add an extra coverage um, before I apply my foundation. And, um, it helps. I like it actually better. So, yeah. Um, number five. Go for manicures or manicure yourself. Um, manicures are really expensive. And I'm actually going to school, um, to be, you know, to be able to do nails. So, I might as well practice now and not spend that much money on it, I think. Just because, you know, there's so many things you can learn to do. So, yeah. And I'm sorry about that noise in the background. It's um, the wind chimes. You know, the wind. You can see my hair that is, like, blowing crazily. Crazy, crazily? Whatever. Um, okay, number six. Exfoliate lips, face, or both? Um, I exfoliate my face. I don't exfoliate my lips just because my lips don't get that dry and yeah so one second let me text my boyfriend now on to number seven on average how long does it take you to do your makeup if I really concentrate and focus on doing my makeup and take my time it usually takes me 30 to 35 minutes I know that might be a long time but um, if I really want to get detailed and you know do everything perfectly I take about 35 minutes and then I can pretty much do my makeup if I have to in a hurry within five minutes I know that sounds crazy but I can I've done it before um okay number eight do you wear makeup every day and everywhere um pretty much just because I love it so much and you know I want to do that as my profession I think the more I do it and the places I wear it the more practice I get so and I really do get complimented on my makeup and stuff, so that also encourages me to want to pursue that. So, yes, I do wear it mostly everywhere. Okay, number nine. What release are you most excited about makeup-wise? Um, the most brand-wise, I'm 
up on whenever things come out is probably Revlon just because I use their foundation I use their eyeliner and their powder sometimes so yeah that's probably the most thing I'm most excited about whenever it comes out something new comes out I probably just completely confused you about that question but yeah okay number 10 what is your weakness shoes purses clothes jewelry eyeshadow lipstick or other um if I had to choose over all of that it would most likely be purses because I collect purses and it's always been a big thing for me um I always it's the first thing I look at whenever I walk into a store so that should tell me my right there that is my weakness and then I love jewelry um I wear rings the most um I love earrings too. um then probably would come the clothes and stuff okay number 11 do you whiten your teeth um yes I used to wipe my teeth actually every um day that possible and I don't know if you think I have white teeth or not but I would love for them to be like whenever I smiled I would like blonde people you know that kind of bright white color <laughs> um but right now um, well, I'm not really going to go into detail because that could be another video that I put up is about my teeth. So, if you want to see a video, um, t me telling you what I do to, um, keep my teeth like this, then just comment below. Um, the next question is, 12, wax eyebrows or pluck? Um, I pluck my eyebrows just because it's easier for me and it's convenient and I don't have wax on hand at all times and it kind of cost you know a little bit to get them done so why not just do them yourself plucking does hurt let me tell you but you know it's gotta deal with it if you want pretty eyebrows which I'm not saying I have pretty eyebrows on at all I would love to have arched eyebrows but I don't think that's definitely gonna happen <laughs> okay number 13 what do you use to contour um, I usually try not to contour. Today I actually did. Um, and I used my um, Coastal Scents 10 blush palette. And there was like a light brown shade in there. And I just used it. Um, and then I have a Rimmel um, bronzer that I use as well. And that's pretty much it. I try not to do it too much because I don't want to look dirty. And um, I, I don't know. Number 14. False lashes or natural? Um, I like both. There's the time and place for false, and there's a time and place for natural, you know. Um, false lashes to me are just add a little bit more dramatic um, look to your eye. And I have pretty long eyelashes. I'm not saying they're extremely long, but they're long enough to tell that um, I actually have eyelashes. And so I don't have to wear them as much as some people. So I'm very blessed for that. Um, okay, and then number 15, favorite makeup brand. This is a really good question, and I think everybody um, kind of has to think about it. But my two favorite, um, high-end and drugstore-wise, um, high-end would probably be Urban Decay, just because it's pretty much all I've tried so far. And then drugstore brand is definitely Revlon. Just because I use most of their products and they work out very well for me. So, and then also I like Bare Minerals. Also, I don't know, I guess I'd be considered a higher end product just because it is a little bit on the pricey side. Um, but yeah, those two are my favorite Urban Decay and Revlon. Uh, number 16, liquid eyeliner, pencil, or gel? Um, it's between liquid and pencil just because I never. I never use gel anymore because it smudges and gets under my eyes way too much and it's too much of an upkeep for me. Um, so probably liquid is ultimately my favorite just because it lasts a long time and it's very precise. Um, number 17, lipstick, lip gloss, or chapstick? Definitely lip gloss because I've always liked lip gloss. I've always worn lip gloss. Today I'm wearing lipstick. I'm wearing like a pale pink from um, NYX. And 
Um, I don't wear it a lot just because I have to keep reapplying re it. And lip gloss um, kind of lasts longer to me. And it leaves like a shine. And then I use chapstick some. But still lip gloss is my ultimate favorite. Number 18. Pigments, pressed, or cream eyeshadows. Um, I use pressed eyeshadows most of the time. Just because they work better for my eye shape. And they don't crease as much for me. Um, I like cream eyeshadows, but I can never get them to last on my eye for some reason. It's like my eye has a natural um, oil to it, and it just creases like crazy no matter what kind of primer I use. So, And then I have a few pigments that I really like, but I kind of use them um, only when I'm doing like a dramatic look or costume-like makeup, I guess. And then the next question, number 19, is if you had to wear only one product excluding foundation what would it be mine would be mascara just because mascara you know kind of brightens up your eyes and face as well um, as just kind of adding everything together and you know your makeup look would not be complete without mascara so yeah I would choose that number 20 favorite color my favorite color if you don't already know if you can't tell by, by the background of my channel and like my room and all that um, it's pink um, it's always been pink and it always will be pink no matter what I love pink so much it's just it describes my personality really um, well so um number 21 favorite color combination and I'm not really sure if it means in makeup or just you know colors in general um, so I'll do both I'll say both for makeup wise I think black and white look good together like smoky black eye and then brown and black look good together purple and green look great together with green eyes and then um cream and brown look good together and then just color wise like everyday colors i think pink and green look good together pink and black and then green and blue um let's see 20 natural or dramatic eye makeup um, I would probably have to say dramatic if I had to choose one of them over the other just because um, I like wearing dramatic the most. Not saying that natural isn't pretty because I think natural makeup shows, you know, your natural features and everything very well and it's gorgeous on a lot of people. And um, I do need bird. I, I do need to do a natural tutorial because I haven't. I haven't done one in forever. I don't think I even have one listed on my channel. So that reminds me I need to do one. But yeah, I, w I would pick, pick myself dramatic. Just because I, as you can see my eyeshadow right now is kind of dramatic. And I don't ever listen to the go natural in the daytime. And then dramatic in the dark. Because I don't ever go anywhere at night time to wear my makeup. So I always go dramatic everywhere. Which is kind of bad, but oh well. Um... The next question. Okay, bird. Video. I'm trying to do a video. Okay, let's see. Number 23. Do you care more for quality or name brand? Definitely quality. I don't care if I have to buy it from the Dollar General store. If it has better quality, I will do that. Because, I mean, why would you spend more money for a crappy product? And, I mean, it just don't make sense. So, definitely more quality. Okay, number 24. Do you enjoy doing your face mask if so which one um the only face mask that I ever do well actually I did two I, I've done two I don't really do them anymore um the first one would be this green mask and it just kind of makes your pores smaller I'm not really sure um what it's called but I will insert a picture of the bottle here here and then the next one would be um, the proactive refining mask which is like a white creamy mask and you leave that on to five to ten minutes and then you wash it off and those are really the only two that I've ever done I've always wanted to try you know like new um, oat and honey mask I don't know and finally the last one is what is your current addiction okay I have okay the wind ah! <laughs> okay <laughs> Your current addiction, okay, my current addiction is, um, nails. I've been really trying.
trying to use different nail polish. Um, eyeshadow, um, pocketbooks. I have been obsessed with pocketbooks and rings. I love rings. Today I'm wearing my Jesus ring and my um, green ring that matches my shirt. And I think my boyfriend got me this from a local boutique and it's really pretty. And then my other boyfriend ring. I call my boyfriend rings because he bought them for me and I love them. And yeah, that's pretty much all the questions. And I'm so glad that it was less than 20 minutes. So I think I'm going to go and add an outfit of the day. But anyways, okay, for, for my makeup, it's probably really bright. I'm really sorry. It's just the sun's like glaring this way. Um, for my eyes, I'm wearing a brown and black kind of smoky eye. Hair is straight. Well, I didn't straighten it. I just blow dried it. And I um, added a little bit of body by teasing it. Earrings. I'm wearing some green dangly earrings from, I'm going to say they're from Claire's. Pretty sure they're from Claire's. And then I just told you about my rings. My nails are from Kiss um, Artificial Nails. And they have black tips with like a pink design. Because I love colors like that. Okay, then I'm going to stand up. Okay, I'm wearing this green kind of, green and blue. I don't know if you can see that green and blue detailed. And it's a see-through shirt, so um, I just put a white long sleeve shirt underneath it. And then the green shirt I got from my mom. And I think she got it from Express. And it just ties. And then the white shirt came from JCPenney's. I'm wearing some skinny jeans. Nothing special. And then for shoes... I'm wearing these really cute green and blue, and it has a little bit of brown flats, and I got them from the shoe show, or the shoe department, the shoe department, and they're by X Appeal, I don't know if you can see that, and they're really cute, they're really comfortable too, surprisingly, they got like a foam bottom, so, yeah. and you finally saw me in my glasses, I know, I cannot believe, I look like a nerd, I don't know, whatever, but anyways, I have to be able to see, I have like, a negative two point something vision so I need to order some more contacts um but anyways that's it for this video and hopefully I'll be able to do a tutorial after my skin gets better I don't really know what I'm gonna do about it um I'm still I'm still taking my skin vitamins so who knows but until then please comment and subscribe and thank you so much for watching and remember if you want to see um, a video about my teeth I don't know if that's interesting to you guys and um, if so, just let me know um, in the comments below. Bye. I'll see y'all guys later. Bye.